grew up in this neighborhood. And it's so sad that, you know, he was, I guess they say he was walking down the street and with his friend, and they, as my granddaughter told me that he was walking down the street with his friend and whoever shot him was looking for the other young man and not my grandson. And they shot him in his leg. But it's so sad, it's children around here. George Hall is right down the street. That a wreck is. It's so sad. I hate it happened to my grandson. I'm glad it was just in his leg, but I hope this teach him a lesson. His mother had just told him, you do not need to be with that young man. Hardhead care a so behind. He should have listened to his mom. I hope this teach him a lesson. So the young man was his friend? Was his friend. That they were looking for. That they were looking for. I mean, I don't know if, because he was with him. So I don't know who the other young man was that shot him. But it's so sad. And you know, and my heart go out to my daughter because she got to raise him by herself. Because their father has passed. And she got to raise him by herself. And then his birthday is Wednesday. He will be 18 years old. Gotcha. And you mentioned that this was near the rec center. I mean, yeah. how, how bad is that, that where kids play? That's bad. Because look at those small children over there. What if they had been walking down the street? They could have got one of those bullets. You know, it's, it's sad. This May Maysville has never been like this. I grew up, you see where that parking lot is across the street from the wreck? Mm -hmm. It used to be private, flats. I grew up there. I went to George High, I went to Williamson. We could leave our doors open, but not now. But not now. And where are they getting the guns from? Yeah. And what about the 11 shell casings you see down there? That's what I'm I'm tripping about. 11? He could have been shot up instead of in the leg. But see, God sent an angel out to protect him. And God is trying to tell him, you need to listen. He got shot in the leg. So he's on our way to check on him. What's your name? Sharon Luton. Can you spell it for us? L-U-T-I-N, Luton. And Sharon is S-H-A-R-O-N. R-O-N, yes. Okay. I'm his grandmother.